Hello everyone, welcome back. This is Christian. In this video, we're going to insert a new node after the current node. So this operation requires that we traverse the list starting from the head. And once we find the uh, node that we want to replace after, then we'll do this operation. So the current uh, pointer here points to the current node that matches the key that we want to insert after. So let's say we're looking for a cat and we want to replace the frog after the cat then this is the operation that takes place. So first we need to set the new node's next pointer to the current next pointer so we don't lose the, the bond here. And this is gonna be set to the mouse in this case. And then we can go back and change the current next pointer, update that to point to the current node, and that's it. So let's go and see how this is done in Python. All right, so back in the ID here. Now I'm gonna go into the link list in here and create a function. Now, before we do that though, it's gonna be you know very similar to how we do the print up here. We have to traverse the list, but let's also return, create a function called search because we have to search for a particular node in that list. You know, like we search for the cat, right? So let's do that. we do a function called um, um, search. Uh, search, oops, not that one search for a key or particular node, okay? And this is the key we'll search for. And this function will return the node that it finds. If it doesn't find anything, if it's not in the list, then it's just gonna return a null value, All right? So let's do um, the following. So again, uh, we need to um, set the new node. Well, actually the current node is equal to the head. And then we'll do like while current node is not equal to null, none. Then we go into traverse the list. Okay, so if we find the list, if the current node is indeed the current node item is equal to the key we're looking for, then we found the node and we just basically return it. Right, return the current node. Okay, if, if it's not there, then we'll. we'll if it's not fine, it's gonna keep going. So update the current node to the next node. And if it's not on the list at all, at the very end down here, we just return a none. Okay, it's a very simple uh, search algorithm. Okay, so now, so once you have that function, then we can go ahead and do the uh, insert. So we do insert after a uh, key, well after no, I guess it doesn't matter. We need the um, the key that we need to look for, and then the new item we want to search and replace. I mean, insert it into right. So here we have. Um, so again, you can always check to see if the head is null. If self head is null, right? None. Then just return uh, none. We can just skip all together. But of course, again, I already showed you before. You don't need to do this if you want to, uh, because it's kind of redundant. Okay. But I will just leave that for now. So we need to have the new node is equal to the, I uh, will set a new node oops, of the item. And then we need to get the current node. Um, uh, it's gonna be assigned to a search function, okay? So we're gonna search the self.search key. And then we just pass in the key of the item and that will come back as the node. If the current node is not null, then we know for sure that we reach the, we find the key. Otherwise, is nothing happened, right? So we say, if current node, oops, it's not equal to null or none, then we know that we found the current node already, and we just do the operation, okay? So the idea is then, we want to make sure that, we have to take care of two things because when we insert after, it's possible that it might be the last node, which is a tail. So we have to be careful with that. Um, if that's the case, then we want to also update the tail to be the new node, right? Um, otherwise, you could just skip that. So if this is not null, and then we're gonna go ahead and put the new node first. Wanna get the, uh, the next pointer points to the current node next 
So again, so if you find, we're looking for the cat, right? We insert between the cat here, for example. If the cat is found, then we want to insert the new node after the cat, which is in this case, the mouse. We want to point the new ones, the new nodes to the mouse. And then we can go back and then change the current node that next point to the new node. Okay, so be careful how you do this. Again, the order is important. If you do it correctly, it's gonna, it's not gonna work. So that is it, right? But also we wanna check for the tail node, if it's a tail node or not. So how do we know if it's tail node? Well, let's say that we found the caddy, that's, it's at the very right end here, right? So how do we know this is the tail node? Well, you can check the next node if it's null or not. If it's none or null, then we know that this is a tail node. If that's the case, we just want to update the tail to the current new node, okay? So here is the tail. So we say, for here, um, maybe a node here, say um, new tail node. Or just a new tail. Yeah, no, it's fine. So if the current node dot next is equal to none, then we have to put self dot tail is equal to the new node. And that's it. Um, yeah, I think that's it. And then, and then um, yeah, that's, I think that's about it. Let's give it a try, right? <laughs> um, uh, actually, the key here, I actually made a mistake here. Um, no, this is not the, when we search, not the item, it's the key. And um, yeah, we search the key, not the item, okay? The key is the, the item we want to search for. So let's give it a try, save. And I'm going to go in and insert um, let's do over here, pets list dot insert after the key of which one I want to let's, yeah, let's insert right here. This is the list we're looking at, okay? Uh, not the reverse one, just this list here. We want to insert after the cat. So we want to copy the cat. This is the uh, key. And then I want to insert a new emoji. Let's go and get a, I don't know, maybe a, cute piggy here. So you put it after the cat, okay? And then if you know for sure if it's correct, we can print it out. Hopefully it's there. So let's give it a try. And uh, there's too many of these, uh, that's okay. Um, let's turn out the reverse here. Well, yeah, we don't wanna, we wanna make sure that, yeah, we do wanna make sure that the reverse is also true because if it's not correctly linked, it's gonna be any problem. But I'm gonna put here a print statement so we have a, um, you know, some space in between and we should do that. A little bit messy here. All right, so here we go, cross your fingers. And we got some errors, perfect. Um, let's see what I do here. That is something, just give me a sec. I can't see down here, uh, attribute next. At the current node at, um, let's see current, oh, I mistyped the next right here, you can see it. Uh, typo, uh, where is it at? Right here, great. All right, so we go again, let's clear this list over here and do another run. So here we go, we go in here and again, this is the uh, the list, this is the one, the previous list, right? This is the reverse. And then we just replace the pig right in here and then we're good to go. So that's how you do it, all right. So uh, now let's do one more test. We wanna make sure that it's working at the tail. So let's do another insert. This time, I'm gonna copy this again and we will insert at the very end. In this case will be the, um, the, the mouse, right? So the mouse is the tail, let's put it here. And let's go and insert a, um, I don't know, let's go with the lion. The lion's pretty cool. Put the lion at the end. Okay, so it'll be the very last one. And let's give it a try. And here we go. This is the end of the list. It's the before list. We added the pig right after the cat. And then we added the lion at the end of the list after the mouse. And here is the lion. Perfect. All right, so this is the um, algorithm for that, of course. I use the search here just to you know, handle the search part. Otherwise, you would have to basically put this whole thing here inside um, here to get the key and so forth. Okay, so the next video, we're going to do a night insertion, but this time we're gonna insert before the current key. And that is a little bit tricky, so I'll leave that for another video. So I'll see you in the next video.